throw a quick video up there. It's April 28th, 2020. Welcome to Airborne Aids 2030. I'm Toby Lee I'm on my backup channel because people at a motel wanted to hack into my channel and judge me and send police to my motel room when I'm not supposed to check out till May 2nd in Chatter, Nebraska, number one. So I get the backlash from you know people spying on my stuff through the Wi-Fi system. Also, I heard uh, just now from a young man here, I'm off of I-90 underneath the bridge, uh, in a tent. It's windy all day today, man. I mean, bad. I go by a sign a little bit, get a little money, go get a meal. I've been doing that daily. I just seen a young man up here at the gas station. He says uh, he's going west, the direction I'm going. I said, man, check it out. He says they're going to reopen America. That won't last long. That means they have a bunch of test kits. And uh, you, know, you got that COVID, which is not a, a deadly virus, guys. It's a modified bronchitis. And what's deadly is the vaccine, guys. It's going to take your mind and thoughts away where you can't pray to the Holy Father. Steve Benoon on Israeli News Live explained it really well. And uh, I kind of dreamed that the other day. I didn't have a phone for about a week because I left two of them behind the motel room. Now I can't sign into my Gmail magically. So, you know, we have we have false prophets out there, man. We have beasts out there, man, that judge people. You know, a lady sent me $1,100 to check into this motel. And I was judged ever since. Digging through my trash, digging through my mail, watching to see if I was driving my car, and all this baloney and chatter in Nebraska. I went to work at McDonald's for two weeks. I had good, pretty good hours. I had a $360 check. Once I paid my tickets and, and didn't buy any drugs, I didn't have the hours at work all of a sudden. Uh, I call that corruption, okay? I call that hover over, hover over tope. So um, I had to police lieutenant and the whole police force in my motel room over my YouTube channel content in Chattern, Nebraska. The state of known for methamphetamine, guys. As you can see, the perplexity come along and things close down and your hours get cut and everything else. Not, I don't qualify for a stimulus. You know, and I've had jobs the last couple of years. I usually don't file my taxes because I have to move around all the time. And what I've been doing the last three years is working at the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally in South Dakota, where I'm at now. We're not opening this year. Okay. Now to work again, guys. I got two cats to take care of in my possession. I got their food and water. That's too bad. You know, that, you know what, man? I can't believe what the Beast Kingdom it is, man. I don't think the Beast Kingdom's rising whatsoever. I think it's standing tall. With their judgment of me, man. And babysitting me in a motel. Oh, you can find a job. And then they say I had mental problems or I'm a drug addict. The police lieutenant told the lady to help me that. You know, make sure you don't get no more help out of that nice lady. That's good. It's fine with me, man. Probably sitting there with the Holy Father. I want to sit there and watch people be judged, man. I hope the Holy Father isn't offended when I laugh a little bit. Drugs all over this country. Corruption everywhere. Because they don't build. If it weren't for the corruption, we wouldn't have a country. We don't build nothing. And the young man up there just now, I've been talking a lot about the western light in the sky at night. That's KSM-4 satellite by North Korea, man. It's in the western sky every night. You see the new North Star, I call it. It's in the west. And the United Nations is mad because China's putting a finger on us for this bio-warfare. It isn't really... It's the bronchitis that's been modified through the electron of an atom. You know, I've done plenty of research. Check out my other channel from the motel and chatter. Dude, beating on my door. Can't talk about the motel on your channel. Why not? What are you guys hiding, man? I brought the dope into your country or your, your town? Come on, man. I sat there and didn't do any drugs or anything, man. I was accused of it. <laughs> so I could turn them drugs on and off like a light switch, man. I don't need it. I'm strong. I'm, my will is high, man. Heaven, you know. But anyways, five minutes long. Tyson's closing down everything down. I worked at Tyson two years. Lexington, Nebraska. I sure did. I worked, I worked on both sides of the plant. Uh, we're going to run out of food, folks. God bless you. Like, share, and subscribe. And amen.